Japan Dino, the best of Japan to you. Howdy, this is Andy of Japan Dino, and I have for you an S13 Serbia 180SX SRO HKS Super Draga Mafra. So a HKS Super Dragger Muffler, Super Dragger Exhaust, the rear section you can see in the in the photo here, the rear section, uh, from an S13 Sylvia, also good, of course, for the uh, 180SX, any of the SR engine vehicles. Uh, the HKS Super Dragger, like, removed specifically from a uh, Heisei Yonnen, which is a 1992 PS Jusan, a PS13 Sylvia uh, manual transmission SR20 dead engine and in great condition as you can see great working condition and uh, 115 millimeter so a big huge 115 millimeter uh, Deguchi so this is the uh, real charm point of the uh, the item is it has this enormous Deguchi the 115 millimeter diameter Deguchi tailpipe just enormous the Taiko in good condition as you can see there Frangi Mo and Frangi as well in good condition. So Frangi, Taiko, Deguchi, Zenbu, Kire. So we'll run through some further photos and close up here of the Taiko and Deguchi. The Taiko, as you can see there, a few little marks and stains. This is the top side of the, the uh, Taiko. So good condition as you can see. The tailpipe, some stains and marks on the tailpipe but generally good condition. Uh, most of the color there you can see is actually the reflections off the floor. We have the uh, the uh, sort of a golden colored floor there which is reflecting on the tailpipe. Uh, we'll give you some outside shots as well. We took earlier with a, a camera phone uh, to give you a good idea of the actual natural color. The underside, this is the side that would face the road of course, has lots of surikizu. These are scrape marks along the underside. You can see there the Jasma branding on the on the top there for road purposes, so certified for road use in Japan. We'll pass the uh, Shaken, so Shaken Taiyo. We'll pass the Shaken test here in Japan. The Deguchi, again, good, 100% tidy structural condition, uh, but lots of little marks and scratches. And next shot there, showing the connection there from the flange to the Taiko is good and tidy. A few little, little bit of surface rust, but good, tidy condition. And the Rest of the unit, good structural condition, as you can see, nice and tidy. And another shot there, including the full flange pipe. So good structural overall condition. And to the Deguchi, you can see the huge Deguchi, Deguchi 115, so Hyaku Jugo Pai, 115 millimeter diameter, and huge Deguchi. You can see some stains and some paint marks where somebody has sprayed, I guess, the underside of the vehicle and got a little bit of overspray onto the body of the uh, of the taiko there, of the drum. Uh, but it's not affect, the, of course, the tailpipe at all, the tailpipe, uh, no paint on the tailpipe there. The Another shot there, including the flange. You can see the flange there. Close-up of the tailpipe. So you can see some discoloration to the tailpipe. HK has super dragger there, made worse by the gold golden reflection of our floor there. So we'll just have a look at the, this is it, outside, although this time we have the sun reflecting in it, a bit close to sunset. You can see a better color on the uh, Taiko there, or oh, sorry, actually the Deguchi there in the natural light. So the outside shot, you can see the jasmine plate there on the underside. So this is a better indication of the actual natural color of the unit. Bring that up, zoom there. You can see discoloration to the uh, Deguchi. So this is the Tai Ho type, Tai Ho type HKS Super Dragger. The Cannonball or the Cannon type looks like a cannon, has that Cannon Deguchi. It's a huge 115 millimeter diameter Deguchi in great condition, but uh, great structural condition, but some marks and stains on the Deguchi, Deguchi there on the tailpipe. Made in Japan, from Japan. Thank you. In order to serve you better, we have our website at www.japandino.com, as well as our blog, the Japan Dino Daily Fix, where we feature items of special interest. Look forward to seeing you there.